Hi everybody, this is one of several videos related to CVP analysis. Okay, in this video, you will see uh, how to calculate break-even point in terms of quantity and dollar using uh, equation method. Okay, this is the question. Rose runs a home-based cupcake selling business. The price of a cupcake is $4.50 and the unit variable cost per cupcake is $2.50. In average, the total fixed cost per month is $300. This month, Rose sells 100 and 1,100 cupcakes. Okay, to answer this question, you have uh, firstly to extract the, the data related to this this question so the data is like this the price is $4.50 the unit variable cost in this sample question is uh, $2.50 and the total fixed cost in this question is $300 okay if you want to calculate the break-even point using the equation method, you have to 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 use the this equation. The basic equation is a business will achieve break-even point when total revenue equal to the total cost. Okay. Total revenue equal to total cost total cost in the analysis of cvp total cost equal to total variable cost plus total fixed cost okay now how to calculate the total revenue total revenue to calculate the total revenue, the calculation is price times quantity. So you will get the total revenue. How to calculate total variable cost? To calculate total variable cost, the calculation is unit variable cost times quantity. Uh, total cost is, is total fixed cost. Total fixed cost is total fixed cost. So now, we use this formula to find the break-even point in term of quantity. Okay, break-even point in term of quantity. The formula is like this. Okay, use this formula. Price is 450. And the quantity is unknown. We are looking for the quantity. So, 450Q equal to unit variable cost is 250 the quantity of the break even point is we are finding this quantity and total fixed cost for this uh, question is 300 okay now you 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 just solve this uh, this equation 2q equal to $300 Q equal to 150 units so this using the, the equation method you can uh, you can find that the quantity that the business has to sell to achieve break-even point is 150 units and then how to calculate the break-even point in terms of dollar even point in term of dollar so so break even point in term of dollar it, it is very straightforward so in term of dollar so to know the break even point in term of dollar you have to to use this break even point in term of quantity times the the price of 
the cupcake per unit. So the answer is six hundred and seventy five dollar. It shows that from this calculation, from this equation method, you can see that the break even point in terms of dollar is six hundred and seventy five or if Rose want to achieve break even point, she has to sell cupcakes with the total of $675. Thank you very much.